what is up guys, it's the Big Money here and I have some extremely old gameplay for you today. Uh, this was recorded way back in uh, November of last year, so what, about seven months old or something. Uh, or even older than that, actually, maybe eight. Um, but yeah, uh, that's just something I've thrown in the background here because I've really got, uh, I've got some questions I've got to answer for uh, that you guys left in the last Q&A video that I did. Um, so I'm just going to quickly go through some of those and uh, watch what's happening in the background and support Valdez defensive gameplay and stuff. And uh, yeah, so let's move on. So, uh, John and Solkeld, I think is what that says. I'm sorry if I get any names wrong here. Um, it's, you know, I'm trying to do this on the fly here, so <laughs> I might get some stuff wrong. But anyway, uh, he asked me, do you get shit for doing YouTube videos? Uh, I'm guessing you mean from uh, my friends and stuff like that. Uh, and uh, yeah, not really too much. I mean, I get the occasional little um, comment made here and there, um, but not really. I mean, I, I basically just justify it to to them um, because you know, for people that don't quite get the whole concept of what I'm doing or what uh, this whole community type thing is, um, the way that I justify doing it, spending my free time, you know, making videos like this, uh, is I say to them, well, I get paid for something that I love doing, so what is your point? <laughs> so, I mean, I don't really get a lot of shit for it, really, no. Um, in fact, I think some of them might even be jealous. <laughs> Not really. <laughs> um, what do you like slash dislike about the English? Brown noise asked me that. I don't have a problem with English, to be honest. Um, I know there's obviously the old rivalry and stuff between Scotland and England, um, but I don't dislike the English. Um, the only thing that bugs me about um, English is when it, a World Cup is coming up and the whole build up of oh my god we're gonna win the World Cup oh we are amazing oh and then you get absolutely pumped and uh, I laugh <laughs> yeah that's the only thing I really hate I mean there's I've got quite a lot of family down in England and stuff like that you know uh, I've got a big sort of community of family down in uh, uh, Huntington's what the place is called for anyone who knows what that is uh, down in England um, so, I mean, I've not really got a problem with English. Um, but, yeah, what else do we have here? Do, do, do. I'm just sort of like going through all the, the comments right now. I've not got time to write them down exactly. Um, like, I, like I did usually. Um, how do you think the Jets will be like in Battlefield 3? Do you think they're going to be overpowered? Speed demons or slow, low damage vehicles? Um, if there's anything, anything to go by, if you've, if anyone's played uh, Battlefield 2, they, they are quite powerful, but at the same time, it's hard to use. I mean, uh, if they're really, really fast, they're not really going to be able to target the sort of ground targets um, as you know as effectively as, like, say, you're in a chopper or something like that. I mean, if you're flying right through like really, really quickly, I don't think they're going to be overpowered. They'll be, they will be powerful, but they won't be. Um, to the point, to the point where they're just like crazily good. Unless obviously you're going to get people that are going to be um, amazing at them. You do get those people that are amazing at them, and they just rape everyone. Um, like in the game Warhawk, uh, the people flying about in the jets in that game fucking rape everything. So hopefully it's nothing like that. That's obviously because in Warhawk they have the hover mode and shit. So I don't quite know if they'll have hover and stuff on the jets in Battlefield 3. But hopefully they're good fun to fly. Because I mean, uh, like some of you guys know, um, I love flying the planes in Battlefield 1943. But it's, uh, you know, it's a bit different. I mean, that's 1943 and this is going to be modern times. So, um, yeah, so what do you think of the Welsh? What does everyone like, deal with asking? Do you like us? Do you like them? The Welsh. Um, again, I have a lot of family in Wales, so I mean, I've got family fucking everywhere because my gran, my grandma's a Welsh, so yeah, I've got family down in Wales and stuff. So, Welsh are okay. I don't have any problem with the Welsh. Um, again, I don't have a problem with any sort of country. You know, I mean, it's not. I don't go. Oh, I fucking hate that country. Um, you know, no, nah, the Welsh are alright, man. Yeah, they're a good laugh. Uh, what guns would you like to see return in Battlefield 3? Also, what new guns, if you know any, would you like to see? I know no new guns. Um, what new guns would I like to see? I, I don't know, man. Um, I mean, oh fuck, I just messed up the video there. Uh, sort of moved it <laughs> backwards by accident. There. Um, I'm hoping to see different guns. I mean, I'm no big gun expert. I don't know much about guns, I'll be honest with you. Um, some guy gave me a lot of shit on a video one time for saying 
clip instead of magazine. I really could not care less. I don't give a fuck if I get it wrong. Um, but I mean, I'm not, you know, into guns really. Um, but hopefully they do change it up. I want to see something different. I don't want to see, um, you know, the same weapons again, like in the last, you know, the two bad company games have basically got the same guns, with the exception of one or two different weapons. Um, but like I said in a past video when I was talking about Battlefield 3, uh, I'd like to see the um, uh, British uh, assault rifle. It's the SA-80, I think. I'm pretty sure that's what it's called. Um, but I'd like to see that as, you know, something um, that I actually almost had the chance to use one time because I was going into the Royal Navy before. Um, and, you know, we were going to go to our firing range and stuff, but I was ill, so I never get the chance to. I was fucking devastated. <laughs> Not devastated, but, you know. Um, oh, right, okay, I've just glanced at the questions here, and someone's asked me, why did you not go to the Royal Navy? <laughs> that was that was a random coincidence there. Um, right, I didn't go there. I was going into the Royal Navy, for people that didn't know that. I was doing that uh, a couple of years ago. I was, like, training to go... Uh, I had, um, you know, I was training myself up and stuff like that to go down England and go to uh, their big base in Portsmouth or whatever the fuck it is down England, uh, down the very, very bottom of England. Um, but, I mean, during the time I was waiting for that, uh, I went to a five-day sort of uh, training course. Um, I don't know where the base was, but there was this just, like, army, not army barracks, but, you know, it was basically barracks, um somewhere up north, I don't know, um, and, you know, we stayed there for a few days, and, uh, honestly, I could not fucking survive that shit, um, the training they go through and stuff like that, I'm not built for that, so, um, I didn't enjoy it, we got, like, a tour of, uh, like, this destroyer ship, um, that just docked a few days before, and, um, it was basically, we were walking about this big, you know, this fucking battleship, and, you know, I was just looking at, like, the living conditions that people were, were, were in and stuff like that. You have, like, you have one bunk, uh, your bed. You have a fucking bed, and that's you. You don't have anything else. And you're out at sea for months at a time. I really didn't, you know, I didn't fancy that. I was like, no, I'm all right, actually. I would rather go into, uh, I was actually going to go into journalism, but then I decided, oh, look at this here. I set this trap for this thing and just fucking detonated him. I thought that was funny at the time. Um, but I was going to go into journalism, and then I decided, you know, uh, when I was doing a course last year, a media course, I was like, I like fucking television, actually, I'd like to be a director, so that's what I'm doing now. Um, so yeah, I've just gave you, like, my whole fucking life story. Um, I'm, I'm sorry if I miss any questions, I'm basically just glancing at the questions and picking out one at a time. Um, what is your favourite game? Favourite game of all time? Uh, probably Portal 1, because it was a massive surprise. Um, I love Portal 2, of course, but I mean, I knew what to expect then, but I mean, uh, when I, you know, oh, watch this here, right, look, we disarm that charge with eight tickets to go, and you would think, okay, we've won this, it's done, uh, but then, like, a few minutes later, you'll see here, um, they get that, um, but yeah, favourite game, Portal 1 for just how, you know, how much of a surprise it was, how much I loved it, uh, you know, in a close second would be Call of Duty 4, probably, uh, for, you know, that was my first multiplayer game, and I fucking played the shit out of that game, I loved Quad 4, uh, but I've not played it in about, I don't know, 4 or 5, 6 months, something like that, um, but yeah, uh, why is my name the Ro Bit Mooney, but no, it's Big Mooney, 06, uh, this is a fairly, oh, this is a crazy, crazy story explanation here, I'm 6 foot 5, my second name is Mooney, and the account was made in 2006, <laughs> that's it, really, um, you know, that's really, there's nothing to it. I regret the 06 bit at the end because, uh, you know, I made the account back then, back in 2006, so I would rather replace that with my usual CFC that I have at the end, like, of my PSN name and stuff like that. Um, and my Steam, I think my Steam's that. Yeah, my Steam is that. Um, but, yeah, I've yeah, got 06 there, which is kind of shit, but I don't care. Um, but, yeah... Why would you buy uh, Battlefield 3 for PC or consoles? Or, or would you buy it for PC or consoles? Um, I think I'm going to just buy it on PS3. I might buy it on PC as well, but the reason for buying it on PS3 is so I can record gameplay. 
I have my PVR and stuff there. I can't record PC gameplay right now. Um, you know, I'll need to buy a new hard drive for that. So I'll wait until I've got some money before I can do that. Plus, I'm better on the console anyway, so I'll be, be able to churn out better videos for you guys to watch. Um, you know, I mean, I've played on PC and I'm I'm mediocre at PC. Um, I mean, on Bad Company 2, I maintain about a 1.5 KD, which is not bad. I mean, I'm quite surprised I got that high KD and stuff like that on it. And a positive win ratio and everything. But I'm so much better on the console. I'm so much more comfortable. And, um, yeah, so I'll probably end up just getting the uh, PS3 version. Um, okay, I think I might wrap it up uh, just now because uh, I can't find any fucking things to <laughs> things to read out here and the video is pretty much wrapping up. Okay, one more one more question, one more question. Um, do I like any sports besides football? Or to you Americans, soccer. Um, I don't watch, uh, well I mean I like golf, I like um, watching darts if you could actually uh, class that as a sport. Um, I used to play a lot of basketball because you know I'm tall and stuff and I used to be pretty good at it actually. Um, but I don't watch basketball. I don't know, man. I like some diff a lot of different sports and stuff. I watch every now and again, like boxing and all that sort of stuff. Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. I will do another video. If you want any questions answered, leave them in the description below. I'm sorry if I didn't get to your question if you left one. Um, but yeah, we, I'm at 31 and 12, and uh, we won the game and stuff. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys next time. Also, don't forget to rate the video, and there's a link from my Twitter in the description. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.